Hi, this is State Senator Mike Herodopoulos reporting in after another week in the Florida Senate. This week, the budget took center stage. As you know, we face an almost $4 billion shortfall. And in these difficult times, we need to make very tough decisions. And with those, very difficult decisions for families across Florida. I've met with so many state workers. I've met with everyday working folks who are concerned about the future of the state of Florida. Issues like disabilities, issues like Medicaid, issues like education. And sadly, we've got to make some difficult choices. But there is no alternative because raising taxes would cripple an already fragile economy. And so as we move forward this week, we balanced our budget without raising taxes, cutting almost $4 billion out of our budget. In addition, we move forward to what the biggest spending program in state government is, Medicaid. We're making the reforms, going after fraud, giving flexibility to the state of Florida so we move away from the one-size-fits-all solution out of Washington, D.C. These are the kind of changes we must make, a balanced budget, reforming Medicaid, reforming our pension system, finally making state workers pay into their own retirement pay account, which has not happened since 1975. These are the tough decisions. They're not easy, but this is a time for leadership. We would very much appreciate your opportunity to come in and call us. Let us know what you think about the changes we're making right here in the state of Florida. We believe with a balanced budget, no new taxes, we can create a new economy here in Florida, create the stability, the certainty, the predictability that business owners need to know that the government is finally on their side. This is Mike Herodopoulos reporting in with, again, no new taxes, a balanced budget, Medicaid reform, pension reform, and a common sense budget that will allow jobs right here in Florida to finally grow after years of stagnation.